Hey guys, it's Bastia Vlogger back with another video. We've got Rob Van Dam versus Kofi Kingston. Um, so I put a video on just, and it was uh, Stone Cold versus Daniel Bryan, and I forgot to put the right one on. I put the one without no um, me. What is he? Voicing over. So I'm not going to actually be able to find that. I don't think. But if I will, I'll put that back on with the voiceover. Um, if not, you've had a quieter video, which is probably a bit better actually, because you don't have to listen to me yapping on bullshit. So anyway, um, two evenly matched people with high flying abilities. So um, let's just sit back and enjoy the show. Uh, I haven't really been making many videos uh, just lately. I've just been trying to uh, get everything sorted out, and now. I've got a few already edited, I just need to voice them over. So hopefully, as many of you watching this, there should be more videos coming on in the next day and the next day and the next day. Hopefully, fingers crossed. I've got um, about six videos waiting to come on and I've also got five to be edited and I have five to be put onto my memory stick, ready to be edited. So I've got quite a few, I'm ahead of... Um, my things, I'm ahead, so now it's just trying to do him. Reversal there from Kofi Kingston. Uh, also, I'm looking for a new mic, I think, because there is a bit of a buzz in the background, I've, I've just heard. Uh, it might have gone now, but uh, if not, if it's still there, I apologise for that, and I am going to be trying to sort that out in the next upcoming videos. Uh, I had my first like on one of my videos. To, um, yesterday so that really cheered me up if you was the person who liked my video thank you very much I know I'm uh, I'm raving about one like but um, what it is is I don't actually promote my videos I don't go and say I'll oh, watch my videos I just put them on so uh, if I get any feedback straight away from them it does actually it is a big deal for me because I don't promote my videos as such as other people do uh, I just really, I'm just doing it for myself. But if anyone else wants to watch and carry on uh, with my tournament, uh, well, you know, I'm there for you to watch, and I hope you guys are enjoying them. So this is a, uh, I don't actually, I've lost count of what round this is, but um, there's 25 matches, and then there's going to be eight matches to decide some places. And then after that, we'll get into the next round. So uh, I'm halfway through now, I should say. I should say this is maybe 15 or 16 video. And um, Dean Ambrose and the Wyatt family, Eric Rowan, will be on next video. Fingers crossed, of course. It's a Kofi Kingston. It's a very even match if you have been watching it or you, if you've been watching it in. Because I've been talking bullshit all thingy. I might have been taking you off what it's on. But um, Cap Kingston is doing really well. And so is Rob Van Dam. It's an even match. So we must just start talking about the match a bit more now. I don't think I've ever saw these play. Um, but yeah, they're really, they're, you know, they've put a really good match on on this one. I, I enjoyed this match a lot. Rolling thunder there from Rob Van Dam. And we're going to go for the special move. And here we go. And the referee has got in the way. Nice. Nice. Now that is just like a complete spoiler of the game. But another thing with the referees on this game, what I've been seeing, when they go into like a cutscene of a of like a move, you sometimes get a viewing of the referee's ass. And that really does annoy me because I want to see the match. I don't want to see his ass or his head because that's what keeps happening. And um, I really think that should just make him a bit uh, see-through, like the last ones they used to be see-through. And that would be a bit better. But I, I am looking forward to 2K16. I think this one was just a test, really, of the new setup. Oh, whoa. That was good. One, two. Yes, he kicks out. But yeah, um, I think this was just like a, a first test of the setup, and I think next one I'll fin finesse uh, things and make the game more in depth, and it'll be a lot better. 
Yes. But uh, to be fair, this game has been the best by far of like the moves and stuff. But they did take a lot away from the game. I thought, but I, I still love this game. I think it, this was the reason why I bought the next gen console because it was, it's a great, it's a great game. It's a great game, and I had to buy it. So uh, still really even. Uh, it's too hard to say who's going to win. Uh, whoever loses will go into the last chance saloon. So if you're a big fan of Rob Van Damme, big fan of Kofi Kingston, both of them will be going into the last chance saloon if one of them loses. Well, obviously one of them will lose. <laughs> Kick out from Rob Van Damme there. Off we go. Another move from Kofi. One, two, kicks out at two. He's not going to get an easy, not going to get an easy pin here. Uh, as I've been doing these videos, I've, uh, I always try and make them the best I can possibly do, and I've had to restart a few of them. Um, one, two, yes, kicks out again. But um, as I was saying, I had to restart a few of them because they do a, a silly move on me, and then I don't kick out of the pin. But now I've got the timing down to a T and I can kick out of most things. If you've watched the Big E versus the Miz, that was a ultimate kick out on that one. Um, but yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting used to the controls more and more after I'm playing these matches. And one, two, three. Anyway, I'll carry on talking about that in the next video. But um, as that goes, Rob Van Damme is the winner. I hope you enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up, give it a like, give it a share. Give me a subscribe as well. Thank you very much, guys. Good night.